Mom? I have something that I want to show you. Oh. What is it, Betty? I wrote a book. Goodness, yes. You you did. I see that you're on the cover in undergarments. I really, really want you to read it. Mm. It says right there in the title that it's for teenagers. I mean, why would I read it? Well, in an ideal world, I'd love for you to be proud of me for writing a book. But I'll settle for you reading it just to get to know me better. And maybe by getting to know me better, you might get to know yourself better. <clears throat> Boy, it is so great to have you back, Mrs. Thornton. Geraldine shared some of your recent poems with me. I do hope you plan to stick with your writing. Oh, I do. In fact, this summer I'm going to hit the rails, like all the beat writers do. I'm going to see if I can get at least one great, big, juicy Allen Ginsberg-like poem out of it. Oh, that's wonderful. You'll see what the world beyond Riverdale is like. It's exactly what you should be doing at this point in your development as a poet. Clay, tell me, have you ever read the story The Comet? Of course. Multiple times, in fact. I figured you would have. In that case, how would you feel about writing and directing an adaptation of The Comet as a major motion picture? Is this a gag? I've actually been fiddling with the screenplay version of The Comet for years. Well, thanks to Jughead, I connected with Dubois agents, and it turns out the movie rights had been languishing for years, so I snapped them up. And I suspected you'd be passionate about this. Veronica, I can't believe what I'm hearing. It's going to be an uphill battle. But there are things we can do, like get the right star attached. Someone like, say, Sidney, Sidney Poitier. Poitier. Precisely. Can you get to him? I might not be able to get to him, but we both know someone who can. Josie McCoy. The Clay. If we're going to attach a big star like Sydney, your adaptation needs to be undeniable. Don't worry, it will be. And who needs to wait for summer? I'll get going right away. Wonderful. In that case, I'm thinking a premiere at Cannes in the next four to five years. How does that sound? 